And as lawmakers debate in Washington, save the post office rallies happening across the country today and right here in Connecticut. Fox 61's Gabby Molina has more on the concerns people spoke out about in Hartford. If we fight together, if we're willing to do something, we can win. <laughs> Postal workers, community leaders, and elected officials saying their message loud and clear. To Postmaster DeJoy, you need to resign. Taking part in a national day of action, a Save the Post Office rally was held in downtown Hartford, right in the shadows of the old state house as people stood for democracy. By stripping money and taking resources, vital resources and funding from the United States Postal Service, that will have a negative impact on our rights to vote. Postmaster General Louis DeJoy has been blamed for recent cutbacks and downsizing. At the same time, President Trump has voiced his concerns about mail-in voting. Many worry that ballots are now in danger of not making it in on time. In a place like Hartford, this means a lot of people will be disenfranchised when they go out to vote. So we have a very big elderly community population that goes out and casts their vote. And so those folks won't be able to vote because we're amidst a pandemic. DeJoy testified in front of Congress Friday, giving his own vote of confidence in the system. The Postal Service will deliver, deliver every ballot and process every ballot in, 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 in time. And despite suspending other proposed changes, some worry the changes already made will have a lasting impact. He didn't say anything about reversing or restoring the cuts he's already made. Among the concerns, blue bins like this one and sorting machines being taken down, not just all over the country, but right here in Connecticut. To slow the mail, I mean, literally, to slow the mail means that um, needed medications for folk who can't get out right now doesn't get delivered on time. How will people have that lifeline? Because the Postal Service is a lifeline. DeJoy is set to testify in front of a House committee on Monday. This is our post office. In Hartford, Gabby Molina, Fox 61 News.